Today is uh, Saturday, January the 13th, and we're looking at the German index DAX from an Ichimoku Kinko Hayo perspective. Now, before I start, I'd be interested to know whether you are long or short and what your view is on the market. So put that in the comment uh, box at the end of this video. Really interested to know what your position is currently and where you wanted to go. Um, I, I'd be really interested in that because then in my next video, I can uh, uh, address your concerns or your questions or your, your positions. So let's dive straight in. We're looking at the month chart here. And what I can see straight away is that we've got a very thick cloud here, a green cloud, it's a bullish signal. We have got Tenkinsen north of Kijunsen, and we've got Chiku span north of price. So the month chart is looking very bullish indeed. So looking at the week chart, we can see that we've got a green cloud. We've got Tenken Sen north of Kijun Sen. And we've got Chiku span north of price. And of course, price is uh, is north of, of the cloud as well. So you know, this this gives me a view straight away of a bullish market also on the weak chart. Now, what we can see, though, here is that where this cloud was very thick, we can see that here we've got a much thinner situation on this on this cloud. OK, so let's move to the day chart and let's see what we can ascertain from this. OK, so again, we can see a solidly green cloud, very thick cloud. We can see that Tenken Sen here is set just about north of Kijun Sen, but that's going to change uh, on Monday. On Monday, I expect that we're going to get a Tenken Sen crossing south over Kijun Sen over the, so that's here, Tenken Sen and Kijun Sen I just sat there, and Chiku Span is still north of price, but Chiku Span is moving closer and closer to price action. So let's look at some detail. If I draw a line covering the last nine periods, because Tenken Sen is calculated over nine periods, and we can see that at the moment on Friday, the position was that the high was on this candle just here. Now, when we move to Monday, I will move this line just to the right and Monday's candle would be set here. And we can see that the high is moving downwards to this level. So we will be able to see a drop down of Tenken Sen on Monday. If I now look at Kijun Sen, so that covers 26 periods. And I know it says 25 bars here, but it does mean that the, it, it includes 26 periods. If I look on, if I put the right hand side of that line on Friday's candle and I go down, like so, we can see that Kijun Sen is calculated over the lowest low and the highest high within that period of 26 periods. We can see that on Monday, if I go to the right here, that the lowest low is situated here. So we can see that Kijun Sen is going to go up a little bit and Tenken Sen is going down. So that is a Tenken Sen Kijun Sen crossover, which is a bearish sign. And when we look at Chiku Span over the next couple of days, so I again draw my 26 periods because Chiku Span is the current price set back 26 periods. So I expect that on, uh, that on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, that Chiku Span may 
move below price on uh, did I say Thursday or, or Wednesday or Thursday so that would also be a bearish sign now my feeling is that over the coming week we're going to see price move southwards and I think there's a 60% chance of that so what that could look like is something like this the price is going to come down uh, it will find the first support level on support level one it might even move more southwards towards support level two or even to the monthly Tenkinsen level or even to support level three but to be honest with you because of the thickness of the cloud and it's a, it is a pretty thick cloud I cannot see price in the coming week to move that far south so at worst the worst case scenario I would say that it is going to go down to to about this level here okay so I think there's a 60% chance that this will happen conversely we will we may find that price is just going to motor on up towards the 17,000 17,500 18,000 uh, in the coming weeks uh, as we can see from uh, Kijun's uh, uh, from Ichimoku I beg your pardon so what we can see from Ichimoku is that I haven't got any resistance levels showing at all so price could move up for, uh, uh, northwards without any resistance levels okay so please let me know what you think in the in a comment um, I'm going to be away for a couple of weeks so I won't be uh, producing another video for at least three weeks but I will put updates on my Facebook Instagram and LinkedIn pages so have a look at the description under this video where you can find the link to to um, to my Facebook page and Instagram and LinkedIn if you've enjoyed this video please press the like button and of course if you're not yet subscribing to my channel i would very much appreciate you doing so as well thank you for watching